probably got some work to do. Got a lot of work, a lot of work defensively. Um, and Doug, that team presents a different style of play. I mean, we've been in the NBA mode of guarding different NBA actions, and they present a different problem, which is a great test for us. I mean, it really, um, you know, it really presented a lot of different situations. We had to test a lot of different schemes, but uh, our guys, you know, kept battling, kept battling, kept battling, and you know, we were able to put our will on it in the second half. But uh, uh, you know, a team that moves the ball that crisply and no, you know, move and screens so well and moves without the ball so well, uh, that's a hard night's work. And our guys did a decent job. I was more concerned about our execution offensively. We're, you know, nowhere near where they are as far as getting the second or third option. We didn't do a good job of attacking the weak side and taking advantage of the weak side. And uh, that's something that uh, we had worked on in training camp and we got to get, get better at. Yeah, we had the tempo was was you know kind of is is to our liking. I mean, we got it had some tough turnovers there you know throughout, but that's exhibition basketball. But you know, it gave us a lot to to work with and and uh, to look at and to get better at. How do you think Terrence adjusted as the night went on? He did. He did. You know, typical rookie. He, a couple of of uh, brain locks as far as not knowing where you're supposed to be in offensive sets. Um, you know, typical rookie mistakes, but uh, he did a good job of, of doing his, going to his strength, which, which was shooting the ball. Uh, like I've always said, he, the, he's not, he's not going to lose that strength, that, that skill. Uh, he's just got to learn the other nuances. Uh, did a decent job of guarding their point guard at the point of attack. Uh, I like that. But just the little things, that one casual play where he was, thought he was in the park by himself and Fernandez came from behind and got him. Uh, just little things like that, and but uh, he his upside is is going is is out, is off the charts. What happened to Jose there? Yeah, he tweaked his ankle, and uh, you know I don't you know I wouldn't have burned a timeout if he was going to be okay. But he just needed a little break to catch his breath a little bit. But uh, he he was okay. He was nothing nothing serious. How troublesome were the results from the free throw line, both in shooting? And Huge. Uh, that that was that was my biggest concern. You know, you put a team on the line 44 times. And that's a lack of being down and being ready. Also, I give credit to their offensive execution. They're on a, I mean, they're constant movement. And you take one break, uh, and they do a good job of putting your weak side in, in a troublesome situation. You know, you know, you think you're okay, but then here comes the roll. So it always was putting us in late situations, reacting late. And a lot of that was their, their action offensively, but a lot of that was us just you know, bailing him out with just uh, cheap fouls. If there's no Kyle for the next three games, it sounds right. like there's not going to be. Is there any merit to changing up the point guard with those other three guys, uh, the two, three, and four position? Or are you going to start Jose throughout? Just, just to, you know, work with Jose and John. That is the main thing with him. Um, you know, just giving those guys some run, giving John more run at the point, uh, and ha let him handle it. May give uh, Jer uh, Jarrell some run at the point. So we you know we'll we'll be okay as far as the minutes at the point guard is concerned. Uh, just don't we don't need to lose Jose but uh, but we'll be okay. So John is more than willing to take shots. Yeah he's 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 a scorer. He's he has that's his thing. He's a scorer but again I like his spirit, the way he approaches the game. He's a leader. You can coach him, you can coach him hard. He bounces right back. Um, you know, just uh, the mistakes he made, I jumped on him pretty good. He bounced right back and made a three. And that's the kind of resilience you got to have as a team. You got to be able to take coaching and don't take it as criticism, you know, and that's something that John does. He doesn't drop his shoulders, you know, going to a, a pout. He responds in a positive way, and that's a, that's a mark of a winner. This morning, Ed told us that his goal for this year was to lead the team in rebounds and blocks. Tonight, he had 10 boards. and. 18 minutes. What did you think about what you said? Eddie did a good job. It didn't. He won. He wasn't rewarded um, in the point category, but uh, rebounding. I thought the game, the speed of the game, changed when he and Amir came into the game. They did a good job of running the floor, creating tempo. Uh, but uh, he and Amir did a heck of a man's job in the paint, and I was happy to see that uh, for Eddie. And again, I've, I've said all along, he's been playing at a high level uh, throughout training camp and all this month. 
Shot's still a work in progress, though. Well, I mean, he missed some free throws, but I'm not concerned. His shot is still still good. I mean, he did a heck of a job of working with the summer, Ryan, and um, I'm not concerned about it. Uh, he, you know, he missed those free throws. Uh, he made up for it by those 10 rebounds. So uh, I'm, I was happy to see him do that. With Kyle, so you're not overly concerned to have him out the, in the three preseason games? No, not, I, I'm not concerned. You know, it's more maintenance. I'm sure if we had a playoff game coming up tomorrow night, he'd be, be able to go. But it's more of a, a precautionary um, rehab, or, you know, whatever the term they want to use. So that's, that's more than anything else. It's nothing serious it's it's more precautionary than anything else i mean again like i've always said i rather I'm, i want him october the 31st instead of you know right now